50s and 60s and even some 70s out there. Tulsa, it's 70 degrees at the moment. 63 in Bartlesville and Coffeeville and upper 50s if you are waking up a little to the west near Stillwater. McAllister, you're sitting at about 67 degrees as well. All right, outside, your winds aren't bad at the moment. They're out of the southwest. This camera zoomed in a little bit, which is why it looks kind of shaky, but it's not as windy here as it will be later on this afternoon. We're going to see those winds out of the northwest today rather than the south, so it uh, filters in some drier air back behind the front. Uh, and then again, also, it's not as warm as it was yesterday. So cold front moving through today. It's just on the edge of uh, Tulsa, so you can see this line extending across parts of green country this morning morning here and around the metro area. It looks mostly dry. You may have a few light sprinkles on your uh, on your windshield this morning. Otherwise, it looks like most of the showers are just off to the west of us at this moment. So you can see with the winds where the front actually is. It's still uh, we're still out ahead of it here in Tulsa, down in Muskogee, Okmulgee. These winds coming out of the southwest winds back behind it again coming out of the northwest. So front is settling on in with these winds and then also with the drier air that's moving in that uh, takes those relative humidities down just a bit, and so because of that, we have a red flag warning that's in effect throughout the day, uh, throughout the day today until about eight o'clock this evening, and that does include Tulsa. Yesterday was just Osage and Pawnee counties. Today it includes Tulsa as well. Future track is pretty quiet. Again, a few of those light showers that we were talking about, those move out though closer to around 10 o'clock this morning, and then we're going to look for clearing skies and mostly sunny conditions into the afternoon. Your temperatures this morning are in the mid 60s. As we head into the midday, we're going to see temperatures up to about 71, and then by the afternoon, a high today of 76 is expected, almost 10 degrees cooler than what we saw yesterday. Yesterday was a pretty warm day for us here across the area. Tomorrow, we're going to continue to see mostly uh, sunny conditions and a little bit warmer across the area for Thursday. Then we cool down a bit for Friday and Saturday. Sunday into Monday, that's our next chance for some showers and some storms. As a cold front rolls through, we could potentially be seeing a little severe weather then heading into the start of the week. So we'll make sure that we watch that as we get just a bit closer. All right, let's look outside.